beautiful, Brian, although it's a little wet outside now. The weather really did hold up for tonight's New Year's Eve activities here on Church Street. There was a parade. There was arts and crafts for the kids, along with a load of other activities near the Burlington waterfront. Here's a little sneak peek of what the first year of Highlight had to offer. A New Year's Eve celebration <laughs> aiming to highlight all things that make Burlington a fun and vibrant city. Would you say it's a good way to start your new year? Yeah, it's like fun and exciting. Highlight is a brand new family fun event featuring arts and crafts, a parade and other activities. What is your favorite part about tonight? The parade. It replaces first night, which ended its 35 year run due to financial problems and low attendance. Organizers wanted to make this celebration more community focused, planning events around what people said they'd like to see. Building this from the community was really, really important to us. Um, one thing that makes an event sustainable is if you have a lot of support from the community, interest from the community, and people want to come and learn what's new each year. New additions included an illuminated waterfront display at Echo, a fiery performance by Cirque de Fuego, and of course... The firework was great. It was like U.S. style. <laughs> An array of fireworks lit up the sky to celebrate a new year. And new beginnings with loved ones. Now, since this was the first year that first night Burlington uh, wasn't happening, uh, highlight organizers were worried that turnout might not be uh, as high, but they say luckily uh, the turnout, everyone that came tonight was even more than they had anticipated. For now, live in Burlington, Helena Batapaglia, NBC5 News.